it's time for another Visual Studio Code release. Reading code is a significant part of our jobs as developers, and doing so in VS Code just got a little bit easier. An update to the indent guides highlights matching braces so that you can see exactly where they start and finish. This is especially helpful in situations when you're refactoring code with a lot of nested if statements. Creating custom code regions is also helpful in managing and reading code. This feature is now supported in CSS files as well, so you can apply those same management techniques to your style files. As a JavaScript developer, you may be using NPM as your package manager and leveraging scripts to run tasks. VS Code has launched a new viewlet that's available in the Explorer to quickly see, run, and in some cases debug those scripts. First, you need to enable the viewlet through your user settings. There, you'll see all your defined scripts and can right-click on them to see all the available actions. For developers using ES6 syntax, the new Organize Imports feature can now sort your imports and remove any that you may not be using. All you have to do is bring up the command palette, start typing out Organize, and hit Enter. Got a mouse with a fancy middle button, including that wheel? Now you can do column selection by simply holding down that middle button and dragging. Easy peasy. And that's it for this one's release of Visual Studio Code, everyone. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please make sure to share it with your friends and family. My name is Brian Clark. Thanks again for joining me. I'll see you next time. Happy coding, everyone.